welcome back to my channel. It's been a while, hasn't it? I know, I'm so sorry and I say that in every video, but I promise I'll start getting better. Eventually. <laughs> so I created this mint chocolatey look using the Anastasia Beverly Hills self-made palette. I just came back from Cadbury Wells, so you can just tell that I have chocolate on my mind. Um, I tried to keep this as simple as possible and I created this look using one brush and the one brush I used is the one that came with the palette. So to get started, I've already prepped and primed my eyelids using the MAC Soft Ochre Paint Pot. And the first shade I'm going in with is called Sherbet and this is like a matte peachy shade and I'm using this as my transition shade with the fluffy side of the brush. Just blending that back and forth and I'm going to start building this up because if you go in with too much colour to begin with, it's going to be more difficult to blend out. I'm just using circular motion and windshield wiping motions and when it comes to the outer corner, I just round that in slightly at the end. Next I'm taking the shade Fudge which is a gorgeous warm tone brown and I'm taking this on the same side of the brush that we just used. I'm starting off on the outer corner just rounding it off and bringing it in to add some depth and then slowly taking it into the crease. Again I'm slowly building this up because these shadows are so pigmented you don't want to go in with too much because then you'll find it much more difficult to blend out. Cleaning this brush off on the back of my hand, I'm going back in and just blending everything together so it all seems seamless and there's no harsh lines. Next I'm taking the shade Isla, which is more like a frosty blue-green and you can wet your brush if you want to, I'm applying that onto the rest of the lid. I have almond shaped eyes so I like to take the colour slightly above my crease line just to round off my eye look a little bit but you don't have to do that, you can just have a look at how it suits your eye shape and go according to that. Now taking the fluffy side of the brush with no additional product I'm just blending that all together to make sure that I have the look that I want. You can skip this step if you want to but I'm taking a creamy shimmery shade to highlight my brow bone. You can use the shade Treasure from the palette, but I didn't because I have more of a yellow undertone. But if you have more of a pink peachy undertone, then you can use the shade Treasure. Now for the waterline, I first took the shade Prance by Colourpop and applied it to my waterline. But then I decided it was too blue for me, I wanted something a bit more minty. So I took the shade Zulu and I applied that onto my waterline. Next, taking the shade Fudge onto my Zoeva small detailer brush, I'm applying this under the waterline. I like to keep my eyes looking slightly more open, so I only take it in a third of the way, but you can take it all of the way in if you'd like. So to keep this look as simple as possible, I didn't add a winged liner and I just applied mascara and now I'm putting on my Huda Beauty lashes in Scarlet. I actually don't know why I wear these lashes. I mean on camera they look okay, but in real life they are just so big and so false and so uncomfortable. Anyway, so that's the finished look. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, find me on Instagram, and let me know if you have any other requests. I'll see you next time. Bye!